Hello. Hi. My name is Ahmed Alzigate. I'm a second year medical student at the University of Nicosia. Can I quickly confirm your full name and date of birth, please? Yes. John Smith, May 15th, 1979. Very nice to meet you. Yes. My supervisor has asked me to perform a rectal examination today, which involves having a look around your back passage and inserting one of my fingers into your back passage to, to check the internal walls and your prostate glands. And based on the nature of this examination, it's required that you're exposed from waist downwards. How does it sound so far? Do you have any questions for me? No. Okay. Thank you. And the procedure should be relatively quick. It should be painless. It shouldn't be painful at all. It might be slightly uncomfortable. If you'd like to stop at any time, just say so and we'll stop. Okay? Okay. All right. Thanks. Since I'm a medical student, I am being supervised, so my supervisor might need to repeat this exam after I do. Are you still happy to proceed? Yes. Okay, fantastic. And um, are you in any pain at the moment? No. Would you like a chaperone during this consultation? No. Because it's an intimate examination, I need to have one of my chaperones. I'll go get one of the nursing staff to chaperone with us today, if that's okay with you. Yes. Okay. Have you ever been allergic to latex gloves? No. Okay, perfect. So I'm going to go ahead and get the nurse, but in the meantime, I'll give you a few minutes to get undressed from waist downwards. You can wear a gown and cover yourself, and lay down on the examination couch, facing the wall towards your left, and bring your knees as close as possible to your body, kind of like assuming the fetal position. Keep yourself covered, and I'll be back in a few minutes. Can I get you to expose your back passage for me, please? Upon inspection of the skin, I don't see any skin tags, warts, or masses. There are no abscesses, ulcers, rashes, or excoriations. Now I'm gonna go ahead and gently lift up your buttock. Upon inspection of the anus, there are no visible masses, hemorrhoids, rectal prolapse, fissures, fistulae, or sinuses. Could you please strain down as if you're opening your bowels? There are no visible hemorrhoids, there is no visible rectal prolapse, incontinence, or leakage of mucus. Now I'm going to go ahead and insert the tip of my finger into your back passage. Do you feel my finger touching your skin? Great. Now I'm going to go ahead and insert the tip of my finger. How are you feeling? Is there any pain or tenderness? The patient doesn't report any pain or tenderness. I am not able to feel any masses or swellings or any ulcerations. Could you please squeeze my finger? Normal sphincter tone is present. Now I'm gonna go ahead and insert the full length of my finger if that's okay. Examining the rectal wall, are you in any pain or do you have any tenderness? The patient doesn't report any pain or tenderness. There are no masses or swellings that I can feel. Now I'm gonna go ahead and palpate the prostate gland. 
I am able to localize the prostate gland. Is there any pain or tenderness at this time? The patient doesn't report any tenderness. The prostate gland is firm. It's smooth. It's the size of a walnut. I can feel the midline sulcus. Both lobes appear to be symmetrical in size. There are no nodules or masses. You may now cover yourself and I will give you some tissues to clean yourself up. Here you go. Examining my gloves, I don't see any blood or melina. There is no mucus, there is no um, feces, no pus, or no foul smell. Thank you very much. You may now get dressed. I'll report all of my findings to my supervisor and we'll get back to you.